Here's what's coming up tonight on your local one, Brick City. Crusader. Crusader. Hello everyone, I am Mace Man, the Cosplay Crusader. Mass, Mass. Armor. Armor. Armor, cape, cape. cape. EVA foam, EVA foam. Man. 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 My mission, to fight the never ending battle against toxic fandom, cosplay bullying, and to make sure that your convention experience is fun and safe. You know, one of the most cumbersome things about being a cosplayer is finding a place to store your belongings. And many times, a lot of conventions just don't have bag checks. Be a hero and be prepared. Before you go to a convention, make sure that they have a bag check so that way you'll be able to store your belongings. Or get in contact with a fellow cosplayer and ask if they have a car or maybe a hotel room. Ask politely and most importantly, find out when they're leaving or when they're going to another area. So that way you don't be an inconvenience to them when they have to look for you to retrieve your belongings. And if you're the one that's providing a service to your fellow cosplayer by keeping their belongings, make sure that you respect their property. Be a hero, be a friend. Help one another out. Let's make our convention experience fun, convenient, and safe. I'm Mace Man, the Cosplay Crusader, and I'll see you next time. It's horror video game playing fun with your host H.B. Gibson on an all new episode of Popcorn, Coffee and Joysticks coming up next on your Brick City Local One. Hey everybody, welcome to a brand new episode of Popcorn, Coffee and Joysticks. I am your host H.B. Gibson. First and foremost, I want to thank you, the worldwide YouTube audience, for checking out this channel, for checking out this video. You could be watching any gaming video on YouTube. You decided to check this one out, and it is greatly appreciated. You know, this channel isn't just a channel if you haven't figured it out, if you haven't been watching me for the past few months. It's also a martial arts dojo. Yeah. And because you're watching this video, because you decided to check out this channel, you are automatically inducted into my crew of Karataka Warriors at the PCJ Dojo. And what do we do here at the PCJ Dojo? We do a little something called a dragon kick. Very easy. Just follow along. Fighting stance. Dice! Breathe, focus, visualize the target, and dragon! that like button, hit subscribe, hit that bell icon, so that way you can get notifications of brand new content. This game isn't really too old. It's only been out for maybe like a couple of months. In fact, it was released in August of this year from Euphoria Games on crazygames.com. You are a kidnapped child imprisoned by a cannibalistic psychopath. The object of the game is to escape without drawing any attention to yourself. That means walking around the house trying to find tools and pieces that will help you escape without making any noise. And that means you gotta go back to the cage, leave everything that you left it, because if he finds a door or something moved or a drawer out, that's your behind. Now, I did play this game before, but when I watched the footage, it was very laggy, so I had to make some, some adjustments. But the cool thing about this game is that each and every time you play it, the items that you're looking for to help you escape are not in the same place as the last time you played it, which makes almost for a new experience every time. The anxiety level on this game is very high. So without further ado, let's play 911 Pray. Here we go, everybody.
It's very, very tragic. Start playing. Ooh. I mean, I played this before, but the impact is still the same. You were trying to run away from Uncle Frank. Uncle Frank. On the snow. Come on, we are going home. Why do all the psychopaths wear a, a, a Piggy wiggy uh, masks. I, I don't get it. All right, here we go. Uh, let's see. Do it. So. Oh yeah, here we go. Uh, yeah, let me grab that. That's the poker. Use that to. Oh, press one. Okay. So now we go and we take the crowbar. Yeah, baby. Okay, now we gotta put the poker back. And now we gotta get out. If I break the window, maybe I can escape. But that would be loud. There must be something in this house so I can open the window without making too much noise. Oh, yeah. Okay, key. Gotta get the key. All right. Whoa! We out. We out. We gotta get back in the cage. We gotta get back in the cage. I hope he hasn't noticed that I left. I hope he hasn't noticed. Yeah. Now, remember, if you don't close the cupboards or close the drawers or close the doors behind you, when he comes down to look for you, he's gonna notice it and he's gonna come after you. Creepy guy. Okay. Okay. Everything seems to be in place. Okay. Everything seems to be in place. <laughs> Gotta love it. All right. Let's get out. Now, as I said, the items that are needed to escape are at random, like placed at random. It might not be in the same place all the time. So, uh, let me get up. Hold up, let me get up. Oh, use the key. I gotta remember to press the button for the for the appropriate uh, item. Hold up. All right. Let's see. Yep. Yeah. Uh, the items are definitely not in the same place as they were. Uh, so I have to be very careful. I gotta make sure not to cause any noise, no ruckus, no ruckus, no ruckus. Ah, there we are. You see those? Those rubber duckies? Can't step on them. Hold on. Stand up. Let's go take a look. Okay, we're over here, looking in here. Um, I don't think we need that, or do we? Let's take a look. 
Well, for the benefit of those who have never played the game before. Hmm. Yeah. I, I never really saw any clues on this, actually. So let's, uh... All right, hold on, hold on. All right, come on, put it back. Put it back. Okay, did I put it? Sure. The drawer, buddy. All right, let's see, make sure. Okay, we'll look around. Okay. Okay, that's the soup. Okay, let's uh, get down. Ah. Hit me in the face. Ah. Okay. Ladle handle. That's gonna come in handy later. Okay. Whew. Now, even though I know that, you know, as long as I stay on my toes, as long as I, you know, stay away from making any noise, the game is still very, very tense. Let's be careful of the ducks. Be careful of the ducks. Don't hit the ducks. All right, that's not, okay. Okay, that's a safe. Uh, we're gonna cut, we're gonna close that. And we're gonna avoid the ducks. Okay. Is there anything here? Is there anything else over here? Okay, looking around. All right, here we go. Going upstairs. Crouch. Oh man, we're crouching like Andre. Okay, I'm gonna walk over here. And I think I'm supposed to actually look at the... Yeah, look at him. Frank Flowers, cleaner. St. Maria Hospital. Let's bounce. Let's get out of here. That's about as close as I want to be to that guy. Oh, that noise, my God. Let's see, is there anything here? Anything here? Ah. Yeah, that's the poison cheese. I remember that. Ooh, the anxiety is still high. So, so what do we do with the cheese? We walk over here and we put the cheese in the soup. Oh yeah, all right. But still, there's some objects that I still need. Um, it's locked. Oh, wow, okay, hold on. What's uh we've got that. Uh hold up. Shut the door, baby. Shut the door. Battery. Ha! It wasn't there before, was it? That's weird. Okay, let me check the time on the camera. Okay, we're good. Um, how many resistors do we have? We got one? I think we're supposed to have two. Check. So, I had to hit the H button for a hint. Because I have no idea where anything else is. Um, really? Over here? I don't see anything. Hold on. Then maybe, maybe it's something on the other side? Oh, there it is. All right, cool. All right, here we go. Don't step on the ducks. All right. 
red. Okay. Now we use... No, we gotta use... Yes, the star screwdriver. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. So, one. Other oh, resistor, five. The resistor here. Okay. And then uh, we turn this over and put the battery in here. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Oh, it's on now. Oh, it's on. Okay. All right, so. Okay. Here we go. Now we gotta figure this thing out. It's like a, it's like a light puzzle. Okay, the anxiety is about to hit, like, high because I can't figure this out now. Alright. Come on, man. You can do it. You can do it. Woo! Figured it out. Okay, got it. Lovely, got the key. All right, let's put this thing back, shut the bloody door. All right. Okay. All right, open the door. Okay, we're going in the basement. We're in the basement. Learning to print. Okay, lock pick. <laughs> lock pick. <laughs> oh, uh, and Jill, take this lock pick. It would be a good idea if you, the master of unlocking, take it with you. Y'all don't know nothing about that. Original Resident Evil fans know. Okay. All right. Let's use the lock pick. So let's take that screwdriver. We need that. Definitely need that. All right. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Oh, empty. Hmm. It means he's already put it somewhere. Yeah, I think we picked that up already, didn't we? All right. Let's put that down. All right. Come on. Let's go. Guess open. It's a glass cutter dish. All right. What's that? Okay. What is that? It. Yeah. It's broken. But if I fix it. I can get out without making cool. any noise. Cool. All right. I think we might have everything that we need here. I think. Um, do we get the grease? Let's make sure that we got it. All right. All right. Okay. 
right? Okay. Build hybrid SUVs today at Smythe Volvo Cars. All right. Okay, that's another hint. Wait. Put that back. Make sure you put the, everything back, man. All right. Make sure you put everything back. What? What the hell? Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. Really? Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta use the. Come on. This sound. Is it coming from the canteen? Yeah. Yeah. Shit, shit, shit. It's Jacob. coming here. Is that you making noise there? Oh, get in, get in, get in. Oh! I forgot to close, close forgot to shut the door! Yo boy, get in there! Woo! Woo! No. I didn't think to close it. The panel in the fireplace. Bruh. Oh I no. Don't at all. Oh. oh. But you forced I knew. Me to. I knew it. I knew. My second time playing. Oh no. My second time playing this, and I yeah, I screwed up bad, man. I screwed up real bad. All right. So we have a second chance. Oh man, I forgot to close that dang thing. All right. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Let's, uh, let's get downstairs, because I know that we, we screwed up somehow. Oh, okay, um, that one? Oh, wow, you know what? Okay, cool. Yeah, the DW40, I knew it. Oh my gosh. I knew, I knew there had to be some grease somewhere. All right, so here we go. All right. Okay. Okay, I think we got it. I think I got it. There you go. Okay, finally. Good as new. Whoa. Almost. Come on. 
Come on, shut the door. Come on, shut the door. Get upstairs. Get your ass upstairs now. Shoot. Oh no. Uh oh. I got ah, you. come on. Oh, come on. <laughs> Jacob, please stop. You can't change anything. Oh. But I... Uh. I can do it. With the help of all those kids. Uh. you want it or not. Oh, Lord. All right. There's one more chance. There's one more chance. All right, I got. I just gotta stay put. I just gotta stay put. Yo, the anxiety in this game is peak, son. I'm telling you. I didn't have this much trouble. I did actually have this much trouble before, really. Did I poison the the soup? I hope I did. I hope I poisoned the soup. Did I poison the soup? Come on, man. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. Bon appetit, foe. Enjoy. Enjoy. I'm going to watch you enjoy it. I'm going to watch you enjoy it. Yeah. How's the soup? Forgive me for not offering you. No problem. But I've spent enough this month, so. <sighs> To do anything like that. I'm not one of those. On the contrary, I, I want to help. Oh, I know you want to help. Fire scorches. It burns and it doesn't care. Mm. It doesn't care what or who or how much it hurts. And I want to extinguish it. And, and I'll extinguish your fire and mm -hmm. Jacob mm -hmm. you and I are doing the real good here yeah the real good yeah not this liberal done the other chick nonsense mm -hmm. yes, I, I understand what you're saying but to be a man is to act like a man and pay a big price okay I have to go upstairs. Hmm. Thanks for listening. Sure, no problem. I don't, I don't feel Oh, good. what's the matter? We got upset stomach, indigestion, heartburn, nausea, diarrhea. Y'all remember that commercial? <laughs> go get you some Pepto, brother. <laughs> Voila. Oh! <laughs> If you got upset stomach, indigestion, heartburn, nausea, diarrhea. Okay, buddy. Don't let me down. Yes! Look like it's working. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Come on. We out? This time, I, I will, I'll definitely do it. Yes! <laughs> oh, got out the house. Yes. I got out the house, wonderful. The results, okay. Jacob got out the house, Jacob survived. Jacob poisoned Frank. 
So, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. That's uh, 911 Prey. Actually, there was another early version of it that I will be playing sometime in the future. Uh, it came out uh, in March, a couple of months before this version came out. I think it's called 911 Cannibal or something like that. But it's supposed to be a, a much shorter version, a different version, a different story. So one day I'll play that. But until then, thank you so much for watching this episode of Popcorn, Coffee, and Joysticks. The anxiety was real. I love y'all to life, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. I'm in this game like my name is PlayStation. Voice over cosplay, content creation. Don't worry, don't stress, don't fuss. No competition, cause there's room for all of us. Now who I am, who I am, is who I be. My last name is Gibson, initial HB. God up above, Rouge Rose got my back. I'm playing scary games while you watch me react. Sticks. Big shout out to Torture Star Video. You have just entered into a dimension of random geekiness. The X Zone.